And welcome to today's Daily Dominion by Holtz. So it's a Sunday, another full random day. And yeah, let's check it out. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, so no events, treasures, um, sorry, landscapes, etc. But I think there is still a lot going on. So we have a 4 3 open. And I think I saw shelters, right? Yeah, here we go a whole necro, etc. Also, something to keep in mind. Yeah, so I mean, there's tons of trashing chapel, amulet, sacrifice, pickaxe. I mean, siren trash is a card that normally you don't want to have trashed, but theoretically, it's also trashing like a beggar or something you can trash with it usefully. Otherwise, without the siren, you would never get a beggar um, in a normal kingdom. So, yeah, so it's not really trashing. It's easy draw. So siren is draw and stables is draw. Scrying pool, if I see pickaxe, is probably a little less attractive. Um, yeah, because we will get a lot of treasure cards and then the stables will just be more effective, I think because the pool will not really draw large chains, which is normally the big strength if you build action-heavy decks that you yeah, don't even need a lot of pools, a few, and then if you practically only have actions and then yeah, until you green, you very reliably can draw everything with just one or two pools even. Here, I think with all these treasures coming in, we need a few stables, probably two siren sirens, I don't know if there is a plural for siren. Normally they are never alone. The siren, I think it's already plural. I'll check that out and if I'm wrong, I'll, I'll, I'll post it in a, in a comment or if anyone knows, yeah, just post it. Um, so yeah, so we get two siren and yeah, stables and then I think we need pickaxe very early to build up the payload to get more stables and then really uh, build capacity. So we need to be careful that we don't over trash and then, you know, we get, we get, um, we get output too late. This is a big risk in kingdoms like these. And I've definitely lost a few games, uh, where, I mean, I felt great trashing and, and thinning and everything. And then the, yeah, the opponent gets the first loots and then it's a good loot, like an insignia, you can take um, top deck stables or something. Uh, and then suddenly you, even though you have trashed more and, and your deck is, is slicker, you very much fall behind or you never really catch up because they can then still uh, build further and trash on the way and then catch up on the trashing and then you never really uh, yeah, catch up on, on their money advantage because they can use the money effectively every turn. Um, yeah, so we have to be careful here, I think, which is why I wonder if we get a chapel at all. So we have the necro in the three hand. I don't think it matters, but let's think about it. We could do a siren turn two by trashing the necro. On the other hand, the necro is quite cool to have, but I think this siren play and then hit five to get a pickaxe is just too critical. So I think we trash the necro, we don't keep it. I could see some play, but then I, I feel it's a bit more luck dependent if, <clears throat> if you keep the necro around and then yeah, what do you do later? Do you always keep it? It's, I mean, it's a stop card, it's a plus action, but it's, it's essentially a stop card. And then all we ever do is then probably play another sacrifice on top of the siren or an amulet on the two siren. But there's not too much of a benefit. I mean, throw in a few more stables and you have the same effect or even a better effect because you have more treasures in your deck. So I think we do it. Um, so we could open... Yeah, it's, it, it's probably amulet then over sacrifice. I mean, the two VP we might, we might get from um, the overgrown estate does not justify a sacrifice, I think. And then better double trash. And then imagine you have the amulet in play and then a turn later you see the siren. Or you play the amulet 
Hold on, how, do, how does that work? Yeah, the amulet is coming. You you play the amulet, and then the next turn. No, some, something is wrong in my mind. I'm thinking about you. You trash with the amulet before playing the siren, before the siren effect coming in. But for that, you need a village. So we would need a staff or something for that to happen, or the necro. Okay, so that amulet is 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 not as strong as I thought initially. If we trust our necro. I still think it's just better than the sacrifice. It can also give us a silver if we need that um, at some point. So I think we open amulet and um, we skip the chapel. Which is a little, yeah, I don't know. But let me think about if we if we do the chapel, what what a play would look like. You do the chapel and you get... Yeah, but I think this exactly leads to the situation I was describing initially. Then we thin down, we even get an amulet on top or something, or a sacrifice. The silver won't really help us to hit five quickly. And then they play a siren, they get the pickaxe, they might get a second siren very fast, and then they draw. And despite having much more chunk cards, they, they just keep... Um, keep creating a bigger output and once they throw stables in you're dead you don't catch up so i think we can't take the chapel um the chapel is a risk here more than than an opportunity i think i mean you could try to then trash it on the turn after playing it once or something but that's all a bit i don't know i i feel most comfortable with an amulet and a siren open the siren is also an attack so I, I kind of like that. Okay, they do the same thing. Oh, this is uh, of course not good. Then I think we get well another action card. Then we we might we might add a chapel here. The only the only thing I'm hesitating is the chapel is not food for pickaxe, which the amulets are. Yeah, but if we draw the chapel. And we can get a four card trash in that's yeah so let's get the chapel here okay this is sad now yeah this is really sad so we trash and yeah now we get a silver i think Shit. now we're already behind okay yeah they have this um pickaxe now uh yeah we already have an amulet so we might just get another silver and I think we should we should try to um or an amulet. We are drawing five and then another three. And the chapel is among them. So we can do a big trash and then maybe down to three. And if we take an amulet, we might just get another siren there. Play then the other one when we seed. Okay, let's do this. Okay, they they, they hack us down. Now at least we can get this big trash in. We didn't see the amulet, but I mean, yeah, we just had one more card to find. So is it worth trashing this overgrown estate? Yeah, there is not a siren in here, so I think I want the siren in the shuffle. So one, two, and three. And four, maybe. Yeah, we, but we absolutely need the, the pickaxe. There is three more coppers, 60% chance. Two amulets. I mean, we could we could trash four cards, and then if we draw the amulet, we just get another siren. Right now, but we only have one silver. We need to keep that in mind. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, five. Then we get the pickaxe. That seems that seems all right. Okay, and here we actually use the pickaxe. So we trash and. Do we? Or do we get it? No, we have a siren coming in. So yeah. Yeah, okay. And now we get a stables. Okay. Yeah, and here we get our um we get our second siren. We don't need the chapel anymore. We are quite thin. I, I think we are back, but they have two pickaxes, so we need to be careful. And they have a gold. No, we have the gold because we got the sad doubloons, right? Yeah, okay. I mean, that is something we can't control. Yeah, doubloons is certainly bad. 
here. On the other hand, it helps us to get another pickaxe very, very fast. Now we just need to find that other, um, that's really important to find that other siren. Don't bottom deck, man. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, gosh. Oh, that's, that's, that's devastating. Um, yeah, I mean, we need to trash the silver here. Okay. This is not as bad as usual. I think we just get two stables and play with one pickaxe still. Yeah, we still have the amulet coming in. Yeah, we have enough trashing. So two stables, yeah, because we only have one. Yeah, I mean, they kill their... Um, three pickaxes seems a little bit over the top for me. But let's see. Let's just draw stuff. Yeah, we draw into the shuffle. It doesn't matter. Because um, we will draw with Siren. The question is, do we kill the Siren? Look, there's just two, two curses left. We will not get to play another one if we have enough. Yeah, we don't have a plus buy here. Oh, we do from the chalice. So let's just play and then think. Um, four. So options are, I mean, we have 11. I think we don't trash the siren. We just trash the curse and we get a pickaxe. And yeah, and then we trash the amulet next turn. Yeah, we don't trash the diploons here. No, I don't think so. Oh, we only have nine then. I think it's all right. Let's trash because we, we want to find this siren. And now, yeah, I think it, I think it's another pickaxe. We have a siren down. We have three stables. That's fine. This guy, well, let's think about a berserker, but they have a um, siren down. No, then as, the idea is it's fodder for pickaxe. But as long as we only have one pickaxe, it doesn't. And I think the sacrifice is better just as a, as a backup if we... I yeah, need the action. Or is it just a silver? I don't know. We trash this guy. Okay. Yeah, now, now we're definitely in the game. Yeah, they, they keep... Okay, that's... I think they're messing up. I think that one bottom deck, bottom deck siren should have been enough against someone who plays ideally here to... Yeah basically kill you um yeah i think we we keep playing the siren for now and we keep that amulet maybe over the sacrifice mm. let's 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 fetch the sacrifice first maybe yeah we definitely need one more buy minimum to get those stables and then we need to watch the piles because they will get a lot of buys if they keep they have a siren down right yeah I wish they, they hadn't, but yeah, so let's do this first. Another chalice. Mm, it's it's okay, but it's not. Yeah, then we need to trash the amulet, I think. Okay, sextant is great. Good. So now we have 15, which is um, one, two. Yeah, I wonder if we can then, you know, trash the siren and use the amulet to get rid of the curses. I mean, I'd love to have um, a staff here. A staff is probably the, the best. Do they have one? It's probably the best loot here. Insignia was good when you were not reliable with your deck yet. But now I think it's staff. Yeah, or maybe like a hammer and a, and an orb combination where you can get a, an amulet into play. But that's worse than a staff. A staff is more direct. And you need both of these loots. But yeah, I think I want more loot. So how do we get those? Is it Does a pillage make sense? Probably not because it's, yeah, they just draw back up. Hmm. Yeah, what is our fodder for next turn? We we don't have any free cards other than Siren.
No, oh, this is uh, like a tipping point. It turns turn eleven, and and the piles are quite low. So maybe we get this berserker here just to have fodder. I mean, they draw deck anyways, right? They have eleven cards, and they have three. How many stables did we play? We got two. We played three, five. They have two stables. Yeah, it's it's very likely that. Um, I mean, in previous games with pickaxe, I saw them trashing good draw cards, which ultimately then yeah was detrimental for them. So this indeed could be like a berserker and a, probably a sacrifice is safer if we need to sack the berserker, just in case. Let's do it. But I don't know. I don't know how to get rid of those curses, to be honest. If we keep the... I mean, we can use the sacrifice. Mm. Which is not good, because it doesn't give us anything, really. So it might be an amulet, berserker amulet combination is a little bit more risky. But with five stables, I'm comfortable. And then we might dash one siren. Play the amulet, who, I don't know. Because then we also have to see an occurs in the turn after the, the amulet play. Hmm. So I'll click this and then now I think about what is the best card. Theoretically, it could be one chapel play, but then the chapel sits around and does nothing. We can feed the chapel to a sacrifice, but that all seems a little bit sketchy. So the play would be next turn, and we we chapel the two coppers and the curse, and we feed the berserker to the pickaxe, and we trash one other siren. Okay, we, we do that. My gut feel is with these low piles, we, we need to get rid of those curses. Okay. I mean, they discarded crap, right? They draw deck anyway, so I'm not really concerned. Okay, they just keep trashing copper. So what, what's happening here? You're, you could, you're completely messing up AI. Um, I don't know what's happening with you, but this is not good. Yeah. So now we, we keep going, keep going. Okay, we drew. I mean, I expected that if they line up, we, we would draw. And now we don't play this Berserker. Um, what did I say earlier? We play the chapel, right? One, two, three, four. And now we sack those two guys. Yeah, sad, no staff. But this should definitely allow us to draw. I mean, we, we, we kill the copper for sure. And now, do we now this or next turn? We have 16. That's definitely a province. I mean, they will get payload next turn, but they totally missed to get any loots so far. I mean, there's 24 and we have two, three, four, five, right? We have two chalices. Yeah, they only have one loot. I mean, they're, they have nothing. So if uh, they might get a sword, which is then harming us actually now, because we don't have a siren, they might do some berserker stuff. Yeah, we, we do a now and this one, and we get, I think it's just a province and two stables. Or it's a province, a stables, and then another berserker. So click province, think later, right? Yeah, because the pile, piles are still not low enough. And click stables, also fine. And now we need food for those pickaxes. Yeah, I think this is Berserker Sacrifice, and the sack can actually kill the chapel. And then we might just kill one. 
the berserker with the pickaxe and we might use the other one on the doubloons for example if we absolutely need the plus pi let's do that I, I feel that's quite good okay I mean the attack is ridiculous it, it's actually helpful for them but it doesn't matter um, yeah okay now this is exactly <laughs> they got their sword probably they already had it right trash is no gains a sword to their hand and a shield okay now they are all trashing all their the cards. Okay, they got 13. And then some weird trashing combo with Siren. Okay, whatever. Um, I think we can dash this. Dash the balloons. Dash gold. Yeah, dash the chapel. Yeah, right. We still drew, so that's great. But I think here we play our Siren. Um, yeah, because it's probably the last turn coming up. Let's see if we can pile somehow. This is 15, 20. 20. So if we get a Siren, then it's only... Uh, Seventeen, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I think that's already it, right? Because we only need, and do we have enough buys? Is the question. We have three buys, four buys, five. Yeah, I think that, that, that's it. That's game. And we don't play the siren. Yeah, they can discard. We trash it rather. And I think we could be trashing the, yeah, not the province. We could be trashing the doubloons or the gold. Because the only one, um, the only loot that only gives us plus one is, is chalice. So if we get a hammer or something, yeah, so we can use it on the doubloons, whatever. Okay. And this, if I didn't miscount, this is then the win. Okay, great. Yeah, that's it. One, two, three, four, and a touchy. Yeah, I mean, the AI may stop. I think they were, I felt they were a hit. With that one siren bottom decking, uh, I think they, they should have beat us. Uh, so a bit luck there. 13 turns is good. Uh, well, it was a three pile, so it's not that surprising that it's fast then. Cool game. Um, yeah, the month is going great. I think that one, that, that was a bit painful. But the other games, they were all, um, yeah, very close. But I, I felt I, um, or the AI, kind of were not stringent enough on their strategies in any of those. They got a bit luckier maybe in some games, but they were not stringent enough, and then we could still win. This was another one I think today where, uh, yeah, a, a strong opponent with equal draws than the AI at the beginning. I think they would they would have beaten us, but yeah. Still happy it worked out, and thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.